I am staying at Yotel. It's a hotel right next to Times Square in Manhattan, New York. I love this hotel and I'm definitely going to stay here again. It's super clean. Uh, you're greeted by these things. And this is where you do your check-in. Uh, it has some lounges, which I never really got to use because who sits in a hotel when you come to Manhattan? It just makes no sense. But that's where you would have the breakfast. And this is the covered outdoor. And this is the uncovered outdoor. It's so beautiful. But the thing is that it's really, really cold. So uh, it made no sense to sit outside and enjoy the view. And then there was this thing that at first I thought it was a... Uh, for fishes but it's just fake plants up there you can see some directions on which way and there's also a vending machine if you get the midnight munchies but there's cvs across the street and there's also a liquor store downstairs they use these kids toys bricks to navigate and uh, uh, by the elevator there's these things they can buy tampons toms condoms out of stock, of course, Apple charger, toothpaste, and Tylenol. Okay, so the room, the room was amazing. Uh, I mean, the view, the room itself was all right. Uh, over here, we have a tray, if you have room service, a uh, window. This bed reminds me of a pull-out couch, but it was very comfortable. But I came here for the view, of course. This room is actually uh, not the very basic room. It's like a little, like in the middle. So it was a little more pricey than the cheap room. So this was four hundred dollars. But uh, the other hotels were around between five and six hundred dollars so this is considered cheap and for what you get um i think it's uh it's worth the price considering that all the hotels around here are more expensive you can lower the blinds so no one sees in but i wanted to see the view so i kept them up the whole time the view is spectacular and um this window can be opened slightly not too much a desk with four USBs and two plugins. I think this TV is for like to order uh, room service. I had no idea how to turn it on, so <laughs> did not use it. See right there, the red one, that's CVS. So if you need anything, you can just walk over there. Let's see in here, we have pretty much nothing and just sh hangers. Oh, and also parking. So parking, I really love this because it's underneath the building it's a paid parking it was 52 dollars per uh, night but other hotels had their parking zero point some mile away here's a hairdryer and iron so in other hotels you often had to walk if you parked with your suitcases not fun this was just downstairs so i loved it very convenient the bathroom for some reason i got the disabled room mm, yeah disappointed because the bathrooms are beautiful it has glass doors but this one was the disabled room so yeah it was not as beautiful as the pictures there is conditioner shampoo and body lotion the very basic stuff and a rain for a shower there's also a recycling Breakfast is not included, but you can buy it downstairs. There's also a bar downstairs. And this can be turned off, on. And this is a heater for your clothes. I've never used it, but it's very popular in Europe. Tissues, cups. So very basic stuff that comes with it. But this is the hotel you see for the view. The view is amazing. Uh, that's my favorite part. Look at that. And the LED lights. So I think this hotel is kind of like a Korean style hotel. A beer opener. A very nice. The TV can be opened like this to the side if you just want to lounge in bed and watch TV. What I did not like is how close these this, uh, this is. So when I wash my hands, I would always hit my hand either on the fossil or the sink. The view in the morning. And it's soundproof, so you can hear absolutely nothing from the outside. 
except when you open the window down there. Look how amazing it is. I'm, I'm coming from California, so we don't have anything like this unless you live downtown. Uh, most people don't, so this is such a treat. At night, I didn't want to close my eyes to go to sleep just so I don't miss any second of it. But overall, the hotel, I loved it. I think it's worth the price. Of course, there's other beautiful hotels in the city. Um, but I think this was like very clean, very neat, and kind of fun, exciting. I mean, just look at that. Look at it. Waking up to this view. How amazing is that? I love it. This is at sundown. Um... And it's a very good spot. It's really close to Subway and literally one block or two blocks from Times Square. And this is at night. I hope you enjoyed this video and enjoy your stay in New York.